Today we are going to talk about something called a spread collection operator into a dart which has never been used or which has never been seen on the internet or in the YouTube video. We will only use a ternary operator where we will pass in the unused container or a size box whenever condition is false. So the requirement over here is what if we don't want to render a widget whenever condition is false. So to get rid of that or to satisfy that requirement we have a something called a spread collection operator and we can use that into our list of children's into columns and rows. So over here I have something called a condition and which where I'm using uh, if condition uh, where I'm using a ternary operator where my condition is true then this text is going to render and if my condition is false then this text is going to get rendered so right now if we just take a look on the condition variable it holds a true value and of course it is going to render a text where it is written like I am a false so the requirement over here is what if I want to render a text called I am false or what if I don't want to render a text call I am false when the condition is true. So over here, what happen if what we will do to get rid of that is we can we will just go ahead and create a container and then we'll change the value to a false to get rid of that. So that is a really bad thing because in the container or in the widget tree we have an unused container and we should not pass or we should not put or inject a widget which is not going to get used into our tree so to get rid of it we have something called a spread collection operator and we can use something like this so the syntax for that is if condition so we pass in the condition over here same as the if over uh, same as the if works into our uh, normal programming language and we we don't pass the curly braces because this if is going to be a list over here so we can pass in multiple widgets into our tree so for example right now if my condition is false this condition this if will not get rendered so whatever the widget we put inside if it is not going to render or get injected into our tree so for example if i'll just go ahead and put it over here and i'll command this for a while so right now what happened is if I just go ahead and run it nothing will be appeared onto the screen because right now there is nothing into a widget tree because our condition is false right over here and this block will not this block which is inside if will not get executed because our condition is not getting satisfied right now in the same way you can go ahead and use the else as well just like that so that you can pass in the another objects over here saying that text I am false okay now if I'm going to go ahead and run this I'm gonna get something called I am false so this is an another way to use a ternary operator but in ternary operator we have to always pass a false condition as well which is going to be an unused size box or a container so to get rid of that we can easily use this if condition into our rows and columns which accepts multiple widgets into as a list so we can just go ahead and pass multiple operators and then multiple widgets into this operator and then we can just go ahead and run it and you can easily see over there when i just make my condition true it will render all the text which is inside the if that is for uh, i am true i am true i am true so i hope this video was really helpful to get rid of that ternary operator which has many of many of them is having a question that how do we do that or how do we do that so this was not under in, in the light so next time when you do this get rid of the ternary operator and use the if conditions or a spread collection operator of a dart and make your application work super smooth okay so i hope you like this video go ahead and hit that like button if you i need a support from your side please go ahead and subscribe my channel hit the bell icon so that you will get notified on my next video and i'll see you in my next video with some new information about dart and flutter so see you in my next one till then bye bye take care signing off